afraid he couldn't. Uh, it's definitely a cat. Yeah, I need to practice some more designs. Oh, not on me, you ain't. I'm off. I've got my hair and makeup stall to organise. Oh. And the bottle stall. And treasure map. Oh, <laughs> name that Ted. Oh, don't forget to pick up the teddy bear. Who's doing that? Oh, I can if you want. We're so behind. You'll never get everything done. Yes, you will, Ashley. Listen, better get cracking, OK? Good we'll be collecting jumble today, dropping it off at the village hall. Do you want me to make dinner, then? Well, it might be late. No, it's all right. It'll just be me. Uh, Ethan's got Mother's Union. Ah, oh, great. <laughs> see you then. Bye-bye, oh. little pussycat. No. No. <laughs> You're a tiger. Pussycat, are you? <laughs> Paul's taking me to the cinema tonight in Leeds. Do you fancy coming? Uh, no, I'm all right, actually. I thought I'd give it a miss. Just fancy a night in, really. I want you to wear. Again? I just thought it'd be nice. Morning, Marlon. Morning. Fancy lunch today, Paddy? Uh, no, I can't. I've got to, um, got uh, appointments all day. Sorry. Didn't get those down the corner shop, did he? Mm, they're lovely, aren't they? Bit too lovely, if you ask me. All this for a plaster on a tiny cut. He doesn't mess about, does he? It's not even original. What do you mean? Nothing. Just watch out. Fast cars and flowers and money are seductive, remember? But men like Terry are rare. I know that. Okay. Yeah, look. Right, look, I'll get someone over there right away. Yeah, right away. What was that about? Lionel Dwyer. Tom, I can't find that letter you wanted anywhere. Yeah. Tamsin's probably stuck it in a drawer somewhere. Right. You know, he's one of Jimmy's contractors. He's arguing the toss about the contract. Says if it's not sorted out, he's not going to deal with us again. Pain. He'll have to go. I'm busy. Do you think I'm not? I've got the bank at half past. Look out, you send Carl. What does he know about plant hire? Oh, my flaming useless brothers. I'm right in the middle of this lot. Yeah, you can pick it up when you get back. All right, where's his file? How would I know? Well, do you want me to look for that instead of the bank letter? No. no. My dad's work takes priority. See you later. Hey, you've got the invoice. Failure. Yeah. You're never going to make any money. What are you looking at? Uh, no, nothing. Why? Oh, terrible skirt she's got on. Is she? Yeah. Far too short for a woman her age. I can't say I'd notice. Uh, Marlon. Uh, uh, hiya. Libby. What was the address of that woman up at Hayden's Farm? Hayden's Farm? Hayden's Farm, that's it. Marlon, I'm sorry, I've got to see a woman about her, her horse. Paddy, you've got to talk to me. You can't keep running away forever. I'm not running away. It's this, this invoice is, is very urgent. See you later. Oh, that's OK. Thank you for letting me know. Hey, bye. Um, can I make an appointment to see Paddy? Yeah, sure. Um, I've actually just had a cancellation at lunchtime. Oh, great. Uh, what's the matter with her? Who? Daisy, your dog. Oh, oh, no. It's not for her. It's, it's for me. Right. Um, one fifteen. Hi. Hello. Dad. I, I mean, Tom. I was wondering when you wanted me to sign the severance papers. When you're ready. I'm ready now. All right. I'll bring them round to Home Farm this afternoon. I'll make sure they're done. It'll save you coming into the office and all, won't it? Save embarrassment all round, you mean? But if you don't mind. That would be nice. Hiya. You look nice. Do I? The colour suits you. Thanks. Matthew, um, about the flowers. Look, they were absolutely beautiful. Good. I well, you like them. Yeah, I did, but um, the point is, Terry won't. Why not? Well, I think you know why not. 
Well, just a thank you for uh, first aid administered in a time of need. Oh, so you give people flowers every time they give you a plaster, is that right? Always. <laughs> no, all right, I don't. Only if it's you. Look, I've had a hard morning. I could really do with a scotch. Sure. And about Terry. You could always just not tell him about the flowers. That's a lot from this trip. Still more to fetch. Uh, shall I go on my own this time, see if you can start? No, how's about I go and you start organising? Anything to avoid starting on the blessed cake stall. Start on sorting, could you? Toys, bric a brac. No, no, I was um, to get Jarvis, up. Jarvis, you're supposed to be setting up the treasure map, not playing with the tombola. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Sorry. Oh, hello, hello. Fabulous! Oh, Teddy! Oh, have you got the sealed envelope with the name? <laughs> when you found a table for him, her. Her, could you help Jarvis with the treasure map? Well, I haven't finished putting my bottles out yet. Oh, I can help you with that, Steph. Uh, is this toy a bric a brac? No disrespect, Laura. Bric a brac. But I shouldn't imagine you know much about makeup. Oh, thanks. No? Well, I'll just get on with my face painting then. See you tonight, darling. Yes, I'm really looking forward to it. <laughs> painting. Do you need a hand sorting? Oh, yeah, look, anything rather than go home to all that baking. They've all gone mad. The better one laid up, there'd been all that war between them three. Tell me about it. Diane and Victoria's cakes aren't even edible. You can hide here as long as you like. Just help Terry. Wait, 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 rest at Bumpton. Or do I have to make some? Yes. No, I don't know. Um, I'll come and look. We need to talk about this morning. There's nothing to talk about. Someone had to go. You went. It's a problem and it keeps on happening. Oh, we can cope. Anyway, there's not a lot we can do about it. I think we can. Katie, I think Matthew would like a coffee. And some Valium. Of course, I'll get one for everyone, shall I? Yeah, if you like. Go on. Well, so far, Carl hasn't been doing all that bad. Oh, well, steady on. It'll go straight to me head. So I think he should take over Jimmy's job and we should get Max in to take over the trash. I don't think so, son. Don't think so. It's a stupid idea. For one, I don't know anything about plant hire. Two, Max is a vet and he hates the business. And three, I won't do that to Jimmy. Those are more or less my sentiments and all. You're going soft. One, even Carl can learn. Two, you don't have to treat Max like a spoilt brat all of his life. And three, Jimmy's gone, hopefully for good. Still, it's up to you. You're the boss. It's too soon. Uh, Paddy, it's your 115. Nice, Henry! Hiya, love. Did you... Oh, no. Ma, look, I haven't got time for this. My real appointment will be waiting. I am your real appointment. Coward. Coward? I'm not a coward. I'm just very... So what's going on? You said your crush had gone away. Well, it had. Right, so why? Why were you snogging here yesterday? Well, it just came back a bit for a second, but it didn't mean nothing. It didn't mean... What about the other day? When Viv's rabbit escaped. Yeah, what about it? You told Donna you had to crawl around on the floor to catch it. Well, that's right, we did. It took ages. With the door locked and the claws sign up, come on. Look, we just didn't want anybody to come in. It was a very frightened rabbit. Well, that makes three of us. Come on, Paddy, please help me out here. Please tell me this isn't what I think it is. Hi, Tom, come in. Hello, Zoe. Hello, Peggy. There's a good girl. Well, I think she's expecting you. Sadie, Tom for you. Hi. Now, would you like a cup of tea? No, thank you. Right, well, I'll just leave you to it. There are the papers. Right, well, I've uh, got a pen in my hand. Why don't I sign them right away? Yeah. Yep. Will the money come through soon? 
I'll arrange a transfer with the bank. You'll get it as soon as possible. Thank you. It's OK. Uh, are you sure you won't stay for tea? No, thank you. It doesn't have to be like this, does it? We could still be friends. I'm so glad to be home. You've never seen chaos like it. That's why. All oh, three. What a day. Oh, has it been stressful? Just a bit. I can't tell you how nice it is to come home and find you here. Yeah. It's lovely, isn't it? I feel like this all the time. You know, if we were married. Never mind. Hello, Trouble. <laughs> Are you still up? Yeah, we kept you up for Daddy, didn't we? <laughs> Ooh, you look very red in the face. Oh, uh, yeah, well, uh, she's been scrubbed three times. I've been practising. You've been a tiger, haven't you? Or a cat, and a butterfly, and Princess Fiona. <laughs> and that was a challenge. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky girl. You know, I'm almost too tired to read you a story. <laughs> Never mind, I'll do my best. Come on, bedtime! Yay! Here you go. Come on, baby. Don't do that with you. Come on, then. <laughs> right, say night night to Laurel. Night night. <laughs> then I'll come down. Yeah, then I will be ready. Come on, now. Pearl made another cake for tea time. She nearly forgot to give me something else first. I'm just thankful I'll live on my own. All I have to court with you said and offering me a slice of a fence up court with that. Yeah, yeah, we'll roll on tomorrow. It'll be all over. <laughs> The one we made this afternoon sank in the middle. The one before that sank round the edges. And the one before that was just like a lump of lead. Not more cakes. 
Don't anybody talk about anything else? No. We do related topics, oven temperatures, types of flour, weather... Uh, uh, stop! Did you get the message about the lawyer? Yeah, but uh, I've already taken steps, sir. Uh, stop bleeding me dry, eh? Good. Another drink. Oh, I'll have half tar. And uh, two pints, please, love. Matt's coming over. Right. Oh, I've got your pint in. Cheers. Um, table over there, yeah, Dad? Okay. We've uh, got some business to discuss, so uh, we'll leave you to your drink in peace, eh? Yeah? Actually, it's all right. Let's skip the half. I'll, uh, I'll have a drink with you another time, Dad. So now that's my connection with the business. Completely gone. You'd only just started getting actively involved. You hadn't been doing it long. No, I was always involved financially or on the board. I always knew what was going on. Mm. And I liked all that development stuff. Anyway, it's not just that. It's, it's, a, it's another connection that's gone with my family. You have your real family, don't you? No. I never got on with them. It's the first time I felt I really belonged anywhere. I didn't just have a husband. Tom was my dad. Matt and the others were my brothers. Once this divorce goes through, I'll have no one again. You've got us, and you'll bounce back. Right. Let's get you nice and relaxed. Does that feel better? Better? Oh, it feels like I've got a new bag. You ought to set up as a masseuse. Stress vicar's a speciality. I feel almost human again. Anything else I can do for you? More wine? Coffee? Bit of face painting, maybe? Got to practice some of my macho designs. What, you mean like Shrek? No, thanks. What about Batman? Pass. <laughs> Spider-Man? Pass. Superman? Or maybe Johnny Depp from Pirates of the Caribbean. Now, he is sexy. <laughs> Get off! <laughs> and then come to think of it, I think you're sexy enough. Mm. Mm. I think we'd better stop this. Snarl! Stop. Fish. Brain food. That's all they say. Well, uh, let's hope it works, then. Look out here, they come like Paddy, Paddy, Champ, as if one wife starting now. So, how did it go? Oh. The film was awful. But the evening was hilarious. Yeah. We got chucked out. Oh, <laughs> what for? Well, there were subtitles. He was making comments, very loud ones. I was doing my own translation. Big Gruntley, come out with half a Because <laughs> I'm fluent in Japanese. Do you want another drink? Yes, please. Ta. Ta. She's really happy, isn't she? Yeah, I won't let her down. I will not. And do you want ice with those drinks? Look at the state of you. You thought you'd seen the same film. Don't be so cheeky. <laughs> Diane, you look worn out. Why don't you go home with Jack and I'll finish up here? Oh, no, I couldn't. Yes, you could, just this once. And what I don't finish tonight, I can do with you in the morning. Oh, OK, just this once, thanks. And straight to bed when you get home. Are you propositioning me? Isn't he masterful? <laughs> I could always give you a hand, you know. Oh, thanks, no, it won't be necessary. I know that. You'd be a bit less lonely. Maybe we could have a nightcap. So I could apologise for the flowers if they upset you. Just as friends. <sighs> now, why can't we kiss? We can. I just don't see what's wrong with just kissing. You know what was wrong with it. Yeah, well, I just don't see why we can't. Because we agreed. Yeah, but that's before we knew what it was going to be like. This is just awful. Oh, we've been over this over and over. We've been sleeping together for months before that bishop interfered. Yes, but... 
We're planning on getting married then. Yeah, we still are. Come on. Let's just not tell anyone. What? Let's just pretend. We can't do that. Why not? If he gives us permission, great. If he doesn't, who cares? You never know. You're missing the point. Oh, Ashley, what is the point? So, would you give me a job? Oh, ten minutes clearing up after a not-so-busy night. You think you're barman of the year? I'll take that as a yes, then. Oh, I wouldn't give up your day job just yet. But seriously, I am glad you're here. Thanks for offering. It's a pleasure. Mm. Should I get us a refill? It's OK. I can do it. You wanted. No, I, I told you I wasn't interested. When are you going to get the message? What are you staring at? Me? Nothing. Not your back, did you? No. <laughs> yes, she did. And he's the reason why. Get stuffed. I'll tell you one thing, though. Your pure old bet is off. <laughs> you know, what I don't understand is why on earth God minds two people showing that they love each other. It doesn't... Oh, we're just going round in circles. Look, if we can only show the bishop our commitment... Oh, to... so it's not actually God that's got the problem. It's the bishop. No, right. it's not the bishop. It's me, all right? I'm the problem because I slept with Louise. I need to prove to him that this time I'm serious. I'm not blaming you, Ashley! Oh, believe it. Look, if we can only pass a test, he might come round. Test? It's just like we're kids. I, I don't like it any more than you do. How do you think I feel? I'm sorry, Ashley. You know what? I understand why you don't want to lie. I, I just wish things were different. Right then. Well, I better go home. Please don't. No, Ashley, no. It's for the best. Hiya. You all right? Oh, I'm just a bit whacked, that's all. Um, I cleared up for Diane. She's even more tired than I was. Oh, nothing else, though, is there? No. No, do you want a drink? No, no, I'm fine. Pretty spectacular flowers. Yeah, they are, aren't they? Uh, Matthew sent them. He said they were for helping him out yesterday. Hmm. Bit over the top, though, aren't they? Yeah, just a bit. He's been flirting with me all evening. It's been a right pain. Well, you can't blame him for trying, though, can you? Can't you? No. Well, not unless he's really bothering you. No. Of course not. Good. Hey. Come here. <clears throat> I've been dying for this whole gold day. 